Alright, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Chris Summers. I'm back with my weekly video. Like and subscribe to the channel. Also on Twitch, I'm known as JMS27937. Anyway, let's get on with the topic of the day. PlayStation, PlayStation experience. We're a week out. It's a good job, people upset. I'm not, because I'm a gamer. Prefer Xbox, but hey, end of the day, good games, good games. But uh, PlayStation has won the MPD for November, which, if you got sense, you would have expected it, and you know it. They got three pieces of hardware out. You got the PS4 regular, PS4 Slim, PlayStation 4 Pro. They were supposed to have won. So that out to say it is good. Congrats. Good look. Let's move on with gaming. The only thing that I'm upset with is that PlayStation 4 Pro had no true games that came out and capitalized the power of that console. They relied on playing old games patched up to match the specs. The specs, which is Let's face it, it's not 4K. They run games at 1440 or whatever. But it's not 4K game. Upscale to 4K. Now, with that said, I am going to jump to the Xbox Scorpio. And Microsoft, I hope y'all uh, got people in the corner that are gamers and understand that you can bring out this new console. But if you want to learn from the pro mistakes, do not rely on old games to carry this console over to the new generation. And my point of view, what I think, Microsoft should push Scalebound back, let that be a launch title with Scorpio. Have it built for Scorpio people who have the Xbox One and the Xbox One S, if they buy Scalebound, let them get a downgraded version. But Scalebound, Scalebound should be pushed back to November, December, whenever they launch Scorpio, and let that be built for Scorpio. Crackdown 3 should be held for Scorpio. Give at least two games three, four possibly, but at least two built for Scorpio. I think that was what hurt the PlayStation 4 Pro when it launched, because let's face it, there were like Tomb Raider, 20th anniversary, okay, we had that. Game's already been out. Then they used uh, The Last of Us re-remastered, I'm gonna call it that, re-remastered upscale to whatever and unlock frame rate which was cool but Zero Dawn Horizon should have been a launch title for the PlayStation 4 Pro uh, the new Uncharted DLC should have been a launch title or a launch game to stand alone for the PS4 Pro Sony made a few mistakes but uh, the price cut at the end 350 was awesome I wanted one almost jumped on it but again I'm waiting for next year I'm gonna upgrade everything new 4k TV Xbox Scorpio but with that said y'all let me know what you think this is your boy Cray Simmons aka Cray Doll on PlayStation Network you can find me on Twitch Facebook and always the mighty mighty YouTube I'm out Till next time.